It feels like winter. Winter's coming. And it, it should have been here already. <laughs> I know it should have been here months ago. Yeah. But it's here today. Let's see. What what what, what is this? This is fifty. Oh, this March is March seventh. Seventh. Yeah. March. We've 7th. already had like seventy and eighty degree weather, yes, and, for, and now it's for weeks. Now for it's weeks. cold out again. Gray, cold, oh. breezy. Um. <clears throat> oh. Yes. So I've been watching more YouTube videos. About? I don't know. I, I, I saw some stuff that was pretty interesting. There was this one gal in L.A. I don't even know how to pronounce her name. Cobbett? Cobbett or something? Hmm. And she went to different places. I think we need to do that. I think we need to do some traveling. She did a place in L.A. that was really cool. It's a, it's a forced perspective kind of thing where you think the hill is going up, but it's actually going down, and you put your car in neutral and you think you're 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 rolling uphill oh, that's and somewhere good. down in Southern California and uh, and I think I, I, I mean with that and she went to the um, Griffith Park Observatory which looked really cool they have a big Tesla coil in there but the Tesla coil is only open Tuesday through Thursdays and uh, and I still want to do the tram up the hill in downtown LA. Mm -hmm. I don't know if the homeless people are encamped underneath it. We'll have to find out. And there's a lot of cool stuff. I mean, we 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 done what Vasquez Rocks and I don't know. Was there anything else we did down there? Oh, yeah, We've been we to the La Brea Tar Pits. I've yeah. got some photographs of that. I mean, we didn't take any video. That was back before our our video days. Um, I think we, we're going to need to make a trip down there and go to some of these places. Okay. I don't know. She had a book on paranormal places in Southern or in L.A. And I wonder if there's a book like that around here. I'm, I'm sure, sure for the big cities like the Bay Area or San Francisco <laughs> or Sacramento or something. <laughs> Brentwood? Come on. I went there's... on a ghost tour with Heather, remember? Yeah. So I don't know if there's any books on that. But I, I would love it, too, if... Uh, those people we know who can get us into places who would get in trouble if they if their superiors found out could get us into the um to the um i don't know the, what the, you're that the uh, warm warm spring the, oh, uh, the uh what's it yeah. called um god what is it called what, what town is that it's over? the Hot Springs in Byron. Byron Hot Springs. Byron I would love Spring. to get in there and we know some people who can get in there. But they would probably get in trouble if they let us in. Well, yes, and uh, it is um, going through the planning process. They're trying to. They're going to try and renovate. I'd like it. to get some pictures of it, and um, maybe we need to get a drone. We could stand outside, just fly a drone over it. My luck, I'd crash it, and then we'd have to sneak in there to get the drone. <laughs> but um, yeah, there, I've seen some videos of the Byron Hot Springs on YouTube, and. The kids just have trashed the place. Some of the videos are yeah. people driving motorcycles through it and trucks up it's the stairs. It's, it's really it's, sad. It's, it's, it's a shame. Such a beautiful place. Um, the place is so run down, and they're 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 thinking about rebuilding it. But that's the kind of stuff I'd like to get us into. We'll have to see what the future brings because I may or may not be working in the I know. near you, future. Your health has not yeah. been the best. Oh, you're not supposed to say that. Oh. <laughs> okay. Sorry. But, uh, I mean, that small little trips and stuff like that I think would be really cool. And we would like to show you some of that stuff, too. So, um, I don't know. Meanwhile, back to today. It's freezing. It's cold. And and uh, I don't know what time. It's uh, 10.15. Time changes tomorrow, which sucks because we lose an hour. I so much we love do. it in the winter time when we fall back and gain an hour. I hate it in the spring well, when we spring forward fall. and lose an hour. Yeah. Or fall. Whatever. Um, so, uh, where do you think we're going? Where do you think we're going? We're not, where going, do you think you're we're going? not going where we normally would go. Yeah. We're going to. Oh, there's like only two Erich. places, two places yeah. that we go. So yeah. we're going to the number two place. The number two. Ring the bell. Ring the bell. Taco Bell. We're going to go get a breakfast burrito and maybe drive around town a little bit. 
Yeah. Um, maybe maybe we could stop by that park off of um, Garen, and maybe I could do a little walking around. I don't know. We'll see. And the post office. Yeah, I haven't been feeling that well. My back's out and my hip and my knee and everything. So okay. that's it. We off to the bell. To Taco Bell. <laughs> and pick up our what they called their breakfast burritos. grilled burritos. Uh, they're Fiesta potato. And we get them without the nacho cheese and get shredded cheese. It's kind of weird. They 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 don't credit you for taking the nacho cheese off, but they charge you for putting the shredded cheese on. And they get it without the pico because I don't like the pico. And if you like that, it tastes weird. It does. It, t it doesn't. It doesn't go with the breakfast theme. Mm -mm. And, but if you like their other sauces, use their other sauces. I think it'd be good with some of their other sauces. Some people like hot and stuff like that. So. I washed my hands while I, I had to use the bathroom, so I went in. Grammy waited in the car, so can it's you give cold. me can you give me a little? You know, we're worried about the coronavirus. Oh. Just give me a little bit of uh, in my hands, just a little. Okay, that's good. And then, can you hold the phone? And uh, I'm gonna. Oh. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Yeah, we don't want to get that coronavirus. No. Okay, so we might me... have to go home and. Let me have my burrito. Let's see. Okay, okay, there. So, you know, we don't know without the people who are making this stuff. Oh, gosh, so so here, so can you squirt a little on my burrito? Okay. Uh, okay. And can you Burrell. Yeah, can you um Yes. Can you Let rub me... it? Yeah, I want you to I'm rub gonna... rub it all over the rub it all over the burrito now. Okay. Um, okay. So now okay. my burrito is protected with some Purell. Yeah. And so now we gotta do Grammys. Okay, so we get her, hers, her burrito. Okay, so we get her burrito. Okay. Put some, put some on. Oh wait, undo that oh, cap. Right. Right, we got to make it look like we're doing it anyway. <laughs> so go ahead, go ahead. Okay, and well, um, let me wipe it all over. Uh, yeah, yeah. Get it all over your burrito. Get it all over your burrito. Okay. All right. Okay. Okay. So now we're going to um, <clears throat> eat these burritos. And uh, we'll get back to you on it, okay? I, 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 they might, uh, well, they might taste a little weird with the antibacterial on them, but we'll I do it. I was we'll faster back. than Grammy. I finished mine already. This is breakfast. Yeah, yeah. A little yeah. bit of egg. Potato yeah. cheese. So um, it didn't taste too bad with the hand sanitizer on it. This It had a bit of a floral taste to it. Um, <laughs> it's a little bitter, um, but it wasn't too bad. It says, uh, God, I don't have my glasses on refreshing gel it was refreshing in the mouth <laughs> um let's see Pure, oh Pure this Pure. isn't even purell oh. this is compared to pure purell hand sanitizer this is signature care i think it came from like the dollar store maybe um quality guaranteed so hopefully by purelling our burritos we aren't going to catch the so. the covid19 or whatever but i've been kind of working and grammy's been self uh, Quarantine. quarantining herself in the house um we both have our health issues that we don't want to get it and uh mm -hmm. taking a lot of vitamin c and trying to stay on top of things but let's get back to the burritos they're a bit dry very <laughs> but they have good flavor <laughs> very good flavor so you got three things in them i mean yeah is he gonna drink some water with them or soda if you're drinking soda um because without the pico and without the the goopy nacho sauce, which kind of wets them up a little bit to make them slide down easier. Um, but the nacho sauce on these burritos, I just, I just, I tried that one time and I thought I was going to throw up. And the pico just doesn't cut it for me flavor-wise on this with the egg and potato. And so um, you just choke them down dry. They, they have a really good flavor. Uh, they're on their dollar menu, but like I said, they charge mm. for the shredded cheese. And they don't give you credit back for the pico and the and the nacho cheese, but that's okay. They're still uh, pretty inexpensive. And uh, what do you think? I, like I mean, them. maybe once every couple of weeks or so, we'll get one of those. We've tried the crunch wrap uh, breakfast crunch wraps. Those are actually pretty good. The, we tried the bacon ones. They had a whole thing of hash browns in it, and egg, and some and some uh, bacon, and some shredded cheese. And those are actually pretty good, but they're huge. And it's like, oh, I Yeah, feel, I have a hard full. time getting that one down. Yeah. Um, very tasty, though. Very, very tasty. But like I said, if you like their sauces and you want to put their sauces on, by all means. I mean, whatever whatever you like to do taste-wise. 
So I think that's it. But you know, there's one more thing I think we need to do. Oh, what's that? They got these mini tacos. <gasps> that's right. At Jack in the Box. And we're going to have to do the mini tacos yes. at Jack in the Box. Because we've done the Jack in the Box tacos before. And they're, <laughs> I mean, we've been doing Jack in the Box tacos since we were like probably teenagers, I think, or whatever, or in our 20s or whatever. They've been around forever. <clears throat> and uh, they just came out with the mini tacos. I think we're going to have to try that. And people, you know, I mean, if you're watching fat content, this would not be a good thing. But they're actually no. really low in calorie and pretty low in sodium. And that's why you're able to have those occasionally. Yeah, and I don't think that these burritos are bad, or that bad <clears throat> either. What You get a tortilla, you get some egg, there's a little bit of cheese on them, and the, and the potatoes, right? But it's still, you know, I mean, again, it's, it's not the healthiest meal for Although you. Although Taco you Bell is one of the healthiest restaurants fast food wise to get at least that's what articles i've read and stuff so i think that's it i think anyway, that's it was our, pretty good it was pretty good I, um, I enjoyed it yeah it's not i mean it's fast food it was fast we're actually it sitting was. on the side of the road uh parked oh, in a little cul-de-sac here uh i went in and immediately a homeless person or a vagrant or whatever you want to call him came in said you got any spare change and i feel bad i lied i said no i don't have anything and, um, but I know what's going to happen. They spend, this guy looked like he was on drugs. Oh, okay. boy. All right. He's Ooh, going to spend the money for fight. alcohol or drugs. <laughs> so then I leave this, I, I leave this, the store. I come and sit in the car and we're, I parked right in front of the entrance. The guy comes out and starts doing this weird <laughs> twerking dance looking and then at he us was in our car. flipping the taco sauces like they were cards. He was flipping them. And was we had to get out of there. We had to get out of there. And so we're parked now and we're looking at Jack in the Box right across the street over there thinking, yeah. ah, that's where I got that, you know, the taco thing for Jack in the Box. But that's it. I think that's our video. Very little editing, ed editing, 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 <laughs> editing. Hey, the new computer's working out great. I was able to render a video in like a 10 minute video in like, uh, I think it was like six minutes. Normally it would take you it days. It takes like, on the, <laughs> on the little notepad I've been using before, it would take like 45 to 60 minutes to, to, uh, to render the video. And so, uh, it's awesome. It's, uh. It it doesn't slow down um, when I'm putting it together in the uh, in the screen. Um, the videos would like be all jerky and everything. It it plays smooth through there, and uh, and it was nice and quick, and so um, that worked out really well. Yay! Uh, anything you want to say? No. No, I, I don't think have a voice. I'm almost yeah. on seven weeks now. Yeah, this happens though. Uh, and me, my back is 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 a mess, and my hip, and uh, I, I get to go see a doctor, yes. uh, two doctors this next week about that, and then some upcoming news about my whether or not I'm going to be working or not. That'll come up in the future. So I think that's it. Okay. So that's this video. That's our Taco Bell breakfast burritos, the grilled. Fiesta potato burritos, they're actually pretty good. Well, they're not really that anymore because they've been modified so much without having the nacho cheese and the picosa, but it's still good. Do what you like, okay? I know. If you just go there and get it, I think 99% <laughs> of the people will like it. A lot of people like the nacho cheese. I think it's fine. And, um, and I, I just don't like the nacho cheese. I don't even like it when we go someplace and you get nachos. I like to have regular cheese melted on instead yeah. of the nacho cheese. But I think a lot of people would like it. I think a lot of people would like it with the pico. I think they would just eat it and think it's good. Um, I haven't tried any of the other ones. I only did the potato because I wanted to stay away from the other meats that they had. But they have, I think they have a steak one. They have a bacon one. and a sausage. Uh, a sausage one. Uh, maybe it's bacon or sausage and then the potato, not the steak, but they do have the steak, I think on the crunch wrap breakfast crunch wrap. Um, but we've only tried the bacon one and that is really delicious. If you want to eat something that's, you know, about the size of a, um, small, no, uh, yeah, it's, a uh, corn tortilla. it's about, oh. about that big. <laughs> if not, uh, it's, it's probably a little bit bigger. It's not a corn. It's actually a flour tortilla. It's a big, like 12 inch for tortilla that they fold over. So it's yeah, got to be about six. Is the, is the little hard corn. Yeah. 
tortilla. Oh, well, they and have they... that on the inside, yeah. the corn tortillas on the inside. Yeah. And so it's probably <laughs> almost five or six inches in diameter. And it's really easy to eat while you're driving because it's all contained in that in that flour tortilla. So you yeah. could drive and eat it, and it's all it's like a pita <laughs> or something. It's it's all contained inside there, so it's really easy to eat. Unlike their tacos, which you would never want to eat their regular crunchy tacos while you're driving. Yeah. You would have that stuff everywhere. I know we're I bad. Mean, we can shouldn't be, be driving. And... It can be done, but uh, it would be everywhere. So uh, <laughs> that's it. Next <laughs> next review is going to be these Jack in the Box tacos, these mini tacos. And I think what is it? You get like ten for three dollars or something. I don't I know. know. It's fifteen for three dollars. Fifteen, and then they have the loaded ones that have everything on them. And I, I don't know if we want to try the loaded ones or if we want to get the regular ones. Maybe if we get a small know. order of each. Well, there's only one size. You only get... No, but they have the regular that are just the regular ones, and then they have the loaded ones that have all the junk on them. Yeah, okay. We're going to have to figure that yeah. one out. All right. Okay. Too many right. decisions right now. <laughs> Bye. Bye.